Swissborg. Now, I'm not a huge fan of cryptos that are uh, effectively custodians of your assets, but Swissborg's got a lot of users. I do think this is going to probably do okay, this bull cycle. I think it's probably going to get back to some decent, uh, a decent price, uh, mainly because they're, they're, they're being well recognized within the industry, you know, they're winning awards. They, they've got a solid user base, and I think with a good level of marketing, I think they'll build that user base. So I want to talk about potentially where it can go. Before I get into it though, guys, if you're new here and you don't know what this spreadsheet is, it shows the first 26 coins that I did videos about on the channel. In all the videos, I showed myself buying these coins, the cryptos that I expect were going to make me a lot of money. Now, if you'd have done the same, let's say you'd popped uh, 100 bucks into these coins when I released the videos, these are the prices you'd have been able to buy at. You'd have been able to sell at these prices after 15, 16 months. And these are what your profits would have been. So 100 into each would have netted you over 123 grand. In under a year and a half, you know, it's not bad at all. Now, you don't have a year and a half to sort your portfolios out. You don't even have a couple of months. We're in a bull cycle right now. It's October, known as October in crypto for a reason. If you're not confident in the cryptos you own, it's probably because they're not going to make you any cash. If that's the case, get onto copymycrypto.com. Have a look at what my members have earned. Have a look um, at the, their testimonials. Have a, Watch the videos. You'll see the successes we've had. It's all public record as well. You can verify it all. Copymycrypto.com is where I share with my members the cryptos I own. Whenever I want to buy or sell any coin, I tell my members the coin that I'm going to buy or sell and the price I'm going to do it at. So my members can copy along exactly. They can make the same profit as me, except they don't have any work to do. Read through the site, verify it all. If you like what you see, guys, try out the service because you've got nothing to lose, especially before these markets rip. Now, Swissborg. You know what, before I get into Swissborg, I just want to talk about this. HBO documentary is claiming that they have discovered the, the, the real identity of Satoshi Nakamoto. Now, if that is the case, guys, expect huge shockwaves in crypto. This will not be a small thing. Do not forget, Satoshi Nakamoto owns 1.1 million Bitcoin. That means his net worth is approximately 60 whatever billion dollars. They're saying 66, it depends on Bitcoin's price. Now, it will be very interesting to find out, does this man or woman, but who does this person have the keys for the, that wallet? Because if they don't, we're gonna see Bitcoin rock it up. Because all of a sudden, the supply is a lot smaller than anyone thought because that 1.1 million will be gone if he doesn't have the keys. If he does have the keys, after being doxxed by some pissing documentary, which is clearly not what he wants, but if this man gets doxxed, and now everyone knows how much he has, he might just sell. It's possible. This could actually have huge ramifications for Bitcoin. For Bitcoin, for crypto in general, this is a fascinating thing. I mean, I am incredibly interested to see uh, what happens. And I don't like this. I know this is an article, but the exposure of Satoshi as its alleged creator threatens to raise some huge questions, not least his potential complicity in crimes that feature Bitcoin use. How would he be complicit? He just created the thing. This is idiocy. But, it, but again, would it shock any of you to see governments go after him if he, if, for, for something he hasn't done? I fear for this man. I hope, I hope the documentary has not successfully found out his name and who he is. I really hope he keeps his anonymity. Um, I hope they've just fucked up. But it's going to be interesting one way or another, guys. Anyway, back to Swissborg. So, Swissborg, so it's a um, wealth management, it's basically wealth management, right? It's democratizing wealth management by making it fun, fair, community centric. It's headquartered in Switzerland. They've got an international team of over 180 people. They hold a virtual currency license, which allows them to provide virtual currency exchange and wallets internationally. They have their Swissborg app that empowers users to buy, sell, and swap. 
I mean, it's friggin' it's an exchange, guys. Like, whatever we we can fancy this up, but it's an exchange, right? Um, and they've got a smart yield wallet that gives users like twenty percent, up to twenty percent on USDC. Um, so I'll just accept to that video. There we go. Um, service is not aimed at people in the UK. We always get this shit in the UK. Um, so licensed and regulated, built by investors. One so one point, over a billion dollars total user crypto asset value, over eight hundred thousand verified users, over one hundred thirteen thousand Borg token holders. Now think about that. This has one hundred thirteen thousand token holders. Market cap is only hundred million or so. 164 mil. So think about that. That's a lot of holders. They're also getting uh, well recognized within their industry. You know, proud to announce that Swissborg has been ranked the eighth most innovative SME in Switzerland by PME Magazine. Recognizes and reflects the hard work of a dedicated team, etc., etc., etc. It's not the biggest deal, but it doesn't matter. And fundamentally, look, it is a it's a it's, a, it's an exchange token. That's how we we should realistically view it. They've got some interesting features. They've got you know, predictive uh, app like games effectively like predicts the Bitcoin price of Bitcoin, etc., etc. Um, you can see what cryptos that they have, so they support a lot of assets as you would expect. Um, you can see the yields aren't bad either, like not amazing but not terrible. Um, you know, Cosmos you can earn fourteen point eight percent. That's pretty good. Um, and uh, yeah, you can trade. They've got plenty here. It's an interesting one. I'm not fully like bought into it as a as an idea, but look, exchange tokens tend to do well. This is effectively an exchange token. Now, what's interesting is they're not on many big exchanges. Now, I know they're an exchange token, so they're on, in competition with a lot of other places, but a little partnership with a few different exchanges, and this can actually start bouncing. But the biggest thing they've got to do really is just invest in advertising. If they start advertising, if they start promoting, if they start marketing themselves, this is going to rally once again. I think there's an easy world where this gets back to a dollar, purely off of the basis that we see this time and time again in crypto. Every single bull cycle we see at some point exchange tokens pump. They always pump. And the reason for that is there's always a huge amount of new people that enter crypto. Whenever they enter crypto, when they're new to crypto, they have to go to a centralized exchange. That's always the starting point. And the coin that they get most exposed to is the exchange token, which in this case is obviously Borg. Um, and look, we are almost certainly going to see another year where we see, you know, a huge amount more people enter crypto. So their job, especially in a bull circus, their job is to market and advertise. If they do that well and they can onboard in 100,000 new users, probably going to be enough to tick this up, probably going to be enough to pump this up, but with a good partnership with another exchange, and I'm not saying it has to be a Binance or a Coinbase, it could be a KuCoin, it could be a BitGet. If they can start landing some deals with other exchanges that allows more people to buy their token that aren't using Borg, it can put buying pressure which pumps the coin. Along with get onboarding another 100,000 people, again, would pump the coin. And then we can see Borg potentially hitting a dollar. I'm not thinking it's going to do much more than that, although we have always seen exchange tokens go to new highs. So there is a possibility we could see it maybe get to two bucks. You know, that's that would probably put it at a new all-time high or thereabouts. So there is potential. But I'm not fully convinced by Swiss Borg just off of the basis that I think because it's on so few exchanges, there's not huge amounts of opportunities to buy. You've got to really do it through the ball gap. So like I say, I think their success is hugely going to be determined by how do they advertise, how do they market, how do they push themselves forward, and how and what products do they um, do they add to to their app and everything else that can excite people to come join because there's plenty of people in crypto there's millions of people in crypto that are on binance and all the other exchanges you just need to get them on the board so offer something different to what everyone else does and that would work i think there is a world it gets back to a dollar um possibly two but again 
their success is completely going to be determined by their marketing and advertising. So I'm very intrigued to see how they do that over the next sort of three, four months. Um, if you're a SwissBorg user, what do you like about it? Why do you use it compared to other exchanges? Share your thoughts in the comments below, guys. And look, we are in a bull cycle right now. If you're not happy with cryptos you own or confident in the cryptos you own, do something about it today. Get onto copymycrypto.com. That's the site I run where I share my entire portfolio with my members. They can see every coin I own. Whenever I'm ready to buy or sell any coin, I will tell my members the coin and the price I'm going to do it at. So my members can copy along exactly. They'll make the same profit as me, except they don't have any work to do. On the site, you can see what my members have earned. You can read the testimonials that they've done. You can see our successes. It's all public records, so you can verify it all online. If you like what you see, guys, try out the service because make no mistake about it, these markets are going to rip sooner or later. And if you're holding the wrong coins, you're just going to watch everyone else making money in these markets while you don't. So read through the site, verify it all, and try out the service before these, move, these markets move. And that is it from me. I'll see you there or in the next video. Take it easy. Bye-bye.